Yeah, of course I will watch and uh, I can't wait anymore because I think it will be really exciting. It's uh, yeah, it's uh, in 2014 I did a win on the circuit over there in Hogerheide. So I have great memories for that and uh, I'm really curious who, who gonna take this one. The UCI Cyclocross World Championships are this coming weekend and who better to give us an idea of what will happen than three-time winner Zenik Stebar. He's here racing in Saudi Arabia at the Saudi Tour helping Dylan Gornavigan win the first opening stage and his predictions on the course in Hogaheide, the Netherlands, a world away from where we're at here in Saudi Arabia. Well, he thinks it's gonna be a duel like we all think between the two greats Walt Van Aert and Matthew Vanderpool. You know, it's amazing uh, how they are racing. It's like really a uh, big show uh, for the spectators. Uh, I think that's, yeah, I think everyone is enjoying to, to watching them and they just go flat out. They don't save uh, themselves. I'm happy to see it, so I hope that they will be a little bit tired for the classics. <laughs> a lot will depend upon the weather, and even he says it's unclear who can ride away with the gold medal. It's 50-50, uh, so you, you can't pick one guy. They are so strong. Uh, and I'm sure that Matthew, that he was uh, uh, peaking really for the for the world, because uh, yeah, you could see that his shape was uh, maybe improving. Uh, but yeah, Wout, he he will be peaking as well. So yeah, it will be a really very interesting race. And for sure, with Vanderpool and Van Aert racing the Spring Cobble Classics only two months away at the Tour of Flanders, it bodes well. Yeah, they go for it, and uh, they start a bit later the, with the season. I think they both start in uh, Strade Bianca. So I think that's also a really good move from them, like, you know, to take it a little bit easy after the words and uh, then to build up again uh, towards the classics.